Hi, I'm Don Sladkin, a new donor to Wildlife Alliance, and on day two of my visit to the Alliance programs in Cambodia, I accompanied the Wildlife Rapid Rescue Team, the WRRT, on a mission to release back into the wild a dozen pythons which had been captured a month earlier from wildlife traffickers. After driving four plus hours from Nam Pen to the Kok Kong area of southwestern Cambodia, we traped into the bush with the bag pythons, and as you can see, armed as well with Amy's bug spray secured in her back pocket. First to be released were the Burmese pythons, which can grow as long as 18 feet. Because they prefer a semi-aquatic environment, the Burmese pythons were released into a small stream bed, the first bag producing two Burmese pythons coiled together in a spaghetti-like mass. As they were a bit lazy to extricate themselves, as you can see, they received a bit of help from one of the WRRT gendarmes. Once loose in the water, however, you can see how they took off, gliding elegantly, hopefully, to a satisfactory new home. Next to be released were several reticulated pythons, which can grow to 28 feet in length and are the longest reptile in the world. As they prefer wooded areas, we drove to a separate release location nearby with the appropriate ambiance. The reticulateds are a bit more aggressive than the Burmese pythons, and there are reports of reticulated pets which have made a meal of their erstwhile owners. You'll notice when they let me have a turn at releasing a snake, suddenly the whole team was involved. And very good color because they just change a little bit, like maybe around a month, because they usually change the skin. But they shed the skin. Yeah, they shed the skin. This is Heng Kim Chai on the left, WRRT project leader. And while he's talking to me, one of the big guys is slithering between my legs on his way to the nearest tree. Kim Chai is also discussing the origin of his name in Chinese. Hang means king. Kim means gold. And Chai means luck or power. Hang, hang him in king. Oh, okay. <laughs> Kim, Kim him in the gold. Gold. Oh, okay. Kim. Chai, Chai, also for, like uh, lucky forestry, or forestry uh, something China. like that. What a great name. <laughs> so <good. laughs> you see? Like they feeling like natural, that's why mm -hmm. he can get. Reticulated and Burmese pythons are native to Southeast Asia and are being hunted for their meat and skins as well as for the pet trade. While they're not yet endangered, they're definitely declining in numbers, except in Florida, where Burmese pythons raised to pets have been released by their owners into the Everglades where they become a serious invasive species, consuming everything in sight and challenging alligators for top predator. In effect, they present a clear and present danger to an already fragile ecosystem. <laughs>